Hello everyone, I'm Mike, in-game name Bootleg Gamer or Mikesa, and this is a simple tutorial on how to get the current version of Pokemon White or Black, US or Europe version, up and running on a DSTT or DSTTI. The solution is simply a replacement of the DSTT firmware to the YS menu, which I personally prefer. You can find a link to the YS menu in the description, and if you know how to do that, you can go right ahead. Now before we start the tutorial, we should get to know the problem. If you're watching this video, you're most likely getting the problem load ROM error code equals negative 4. This error comes from games that require a greater save file size than 512kb. Standard DSTT firmware is unable to create .sav files that are larger than 512kb in size, which results in games such as Black Ops and Pokemon to not boot. Now the fix for this is easy. We are simply going to replace the DST firmware with the YS menu. You may want to back up your older files before continuing. Firstly, you can start off by downloading the custom YS menu in the description box. After extracting the zip file, simply go to your microSD card and delete the following files ttmenu.sys, ttmenu.dat, and ttmenu, the folder. Now take the files you've extracted and place them directly on the root of your microSD card. When you boot your DS, you should get a completely different menu than before. You may want to custom yourself to the new menu before continuing. When you understand the new menu, simply open the Pokemon ROM of your choice, and after creating a save file and a SYS file, it should open perfectly fine. And there you have it, a completely ready to play Pokemon White or Black. This may also fix some other games with error code of negative 4, such as Black Ops. Remember, downloading ROMs without having the actual game is illegal and considered piracy, which just ain't cool.